Now it's time for the theme song segment Ooh. here on the mm, Untitled. Podcast. <laughs> untitled <laughs> theme segment. At, at this point, that's just the name. I don't even know at this point. <laughs> that's, that's, that's not a bad name for the segment, it's Untitled. Good, yeah. Untitled. It actually does work. You're right. Yeah, huh. that's cool. I'll take that. All right, all right. So we're going to be talking about Christian today. Johnny, why don't you tell uh, all the yes. people who suggested this on Patreon? Christian! We're going to be talking about Christian's WWE themes as well as, well, his his TNA theme. Because yeah. you can't you can't ignore his TNA theme. <laughs> yeah. um, you, you know. Uh, we had a lot of suggestions for Christian, actually. It was a popular choice this round. Uh, Ethan Woods, uh, username Throwaway, Bryce Chapman, Seastraw uh, Run. Look here, look here, look, listen. OG Hazard, <laughs> Boss Viper, Ryan Rooney. Just Good a few name. people that suggested... Uh, Christian for this one, so it was it was a good one. We had to go uh, with with Christian for this, and my going through the list of Christian songs on uh, xylotthemes.com, he's had a lot of fucking good songs. Uh, he's uh, he's one of those guys I think of when they have rarely ever had a bad theme song. Yeah. yeah, it's um he's been lucky in that regard. Sure. <laughs> um, now we have to have this quick discussion before I don't remember what we decided last time. Do we sure. count the brood theme? Hmm. I, I'm be honest with you. I don't count the brood theme with Christian, but I will allow it. Sure. I think I don't mind leaving it out. I think we left it out of the edge one just because I, it's that's an easy yeah. top three. So I feel like I'd like to keep that out and just yeah. go take the brood strictly. Out, non-factor, boom. Yeah, because it, it's weird because I I don't want to include that, but I feel like you if you don't include the edge yeah, theme that he mean. used, which is more edges theme than his, but he still used it. It's tough. Like, I can't leave that out. But I mean, even if you left the brood in, would it still be number one? That's a tough one. It would be number Christian, one, but I, I, think I, I think it'd be... Oh, you know what? It wouldn't be my top three Christian songs, no. Either way, I guess you, know it, yeah, I guess right. you can okay. count it. It wouldn't yeah. be in my top three Christian songs. Sure, though. I don't know if it would... I'll get to the, you know, I'll get to the end. Let me, let's, 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 yeah. uh, let's riff a little here. So... Uh, we'll go through the WWE themes. He had a, a, a decent amount. Of course, he started with the Brood one. Uh, he had Blood Brudda, which I really <laughs> liked. Uh... That more than I think I liked Edge's like original theme. Mm -hmm. I think yeah, I like this one was good. I like this one too. <laughs> it was a little more methodical. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it was cool. Um, and then of course he used the uh, the Edge and Christian theme that everyone knows and loves. <laughs> then he went on to on your own. Uh, which I this, actually not that one, Tony. Shockingly, uh, well, that was the next one after that. This right? is the first. I guess this is the first variation of him having his own song. It has the and intro, he, doesn't it? He, it has the yes. It does have that. You're right. It so does I, say I, I last year on your own, but it, it does. Doesn't. But then yep. it cuts into like a Queen ripoff. <laughs> 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 I like. Uh, if you guys can find this, I'll, I'll maybe we can link it in the description if we put this on YouTube. Yeah, I'll, I'll link the X Y lot. I'll remember to do it this time. <laughs> oh yeah, we forgot that. last time, but then I think you did. Yeah. <laughs> then, it cut, then it cuts into yeah the, the actual song that you the, recognize the yeah, opera yeah, last, song yeah. yeah. So, I don't know what happened there. I actually like the song, though. Me too. I think it, like I was, I, I think it would be a good tag team song. I don't think it's a good sure. single song for Chris. Oh, say like he was teaming with somebody and they just threw this in for fun? Yeah, I think this would have been a dope, like if he was teaming with somebody else, this would have been a dope, yeah. dope thing to do. Sure, sure. I, I, I think I agree with that. And then he goes on to, uh, at last. At last!
Oh, that's uh, that's the one I think everyone kind of everyone, everyone recognizes this one. Yeah. That's the yeah, that's the the usual at last one. Which, God, that rules so hard. It is. It's it was incredibly good, especially for the time. Uh, yeah, Christian. It, back then, you needed a theme song to stick out. Not yeah. only did he get the theme song, but he got the pyro from the floor, from the Maybe ceiling. The raining Maybe that's pyro right. so sick. It's kind of hard, because like, I look back at these songs, and I'm like, oh, this song's pretty good. But then I also think, like, what was going on around the theme song and the Tron and yeah, the pyro. Yeah, like, oh, the he era. He broke yeah. out from being it's his tough. own, you yeah. know, he's like finally a singles guy. And uh, the whole sure. thing just went together. So maybe that's why I have such, like, deep love for that one. Sure. Yeah. And it's just a fucking good song. It yeah. is. Just kicks yeah. ass, honestly. Uh, and then he used uh, a song called Problem Solver. I don't know how long he uses. I feel like he used this for well, most, used- uh, pretty much all of 2003, maybe. Which is no at last. It's just uh, that that hard riff intro. If you heard it, you guys would know what it is. Um, which I <laughs> yes, exactly. That honestly, this kicks ass too. I love the just it the is really good, mm-hmm. like slowed down version of it. That kind of yeah. Rolls. Also in there, um, you forgot the un Americans theme song. I oh yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I, you're right. That's right. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. I which mean, I, I guess because I don't remember him. Even fuck, supposedly he used it on an episode of Raw. So I guess because it is singles, it does count. But I'm not even gonna fuck it. Yeah, I'm not. I don't <laughs> on this, but it, it's still. It's but you still are correct. The, the you are correct. Of, yeah. And there was another version of At Last too, but I don't think that was much different. Um, and then we get what I consider an all-timer theme. Uh, Just close your eyes by uh, Waterproof. Yeah, Waterproof Blonde. Which God, fucking so damn. Good, yeah. This is a main eventer theme. If I've ever heard one, this yeah. shit. Rules. It really uh, does. God, I don't like. And then, even more crazy is they have that song. He leaves, comes back, and they have a, a story of the year do the song, and it's not good at all. I don't like that song at all. That shit is a, a two pack of ass. Which is no. weird. Because at first off, I know Christian, huge story of the year guy. I just fucking know he is. Huge story <laughs> you think of the so? year guy. He's got yeah, a brown just, story of the year shirt. His, yeah, with his brown shirt, his cargo <laughs> pants. Just fucking, I know he was huge in this band. He used to wear long sleeve shirts with short sleeve shirts on top brown, of it. Brown, brown. Of course. Brown, Fuck yeah, yeah. Brown. story of the year brown. all day. Um, story of the year back in the day was a pretty damn good band. Maybe they haven't aged super well, but man, did they miss the mark on this song. Yeah, I don't know what went wrong here. Cause, and I, I, I'm i sure there's people that do like it, and you know what, you're wrong. But it's, <laughs> <laughs> I, this is just not the song for you're me. But as I hell. said, he did uh, leave for a little bit, and he went to TNA, which, whew, uh, this is uh, it's obviously a uh, Evanescence cover, uh, Takeover mm-hmm. by Dale Oliver. Shout out to Big Dale Oliver. Big my Dale fucking guy. doing it again. God, I, would love, I would love if we could get him to do, do DPW all the songs. fucking music. Oh, yeah, my please. God. Um, he, there was a few different versions of this in TNA, but they all are pretty much the same. I think there's just some kind of, some have intro cuts, maybe some have like a different guitar. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah. all in all, it's the same, uh, Evanescence, My Last Breath song, and god damn. It's just counted as TNA theme, pretty much. How, you, He's here. how, uh, how, like, I don't, I don't know, like, I wouldn't say this made him in TNA, because that's a little crazy, but like, that song like made him feel like a big deal to me. I don't know why. I can't explain it. There's some songs that just kind of do that, 
Mm-hmm. Uh, and his entrance went so well with it. With the countdown, yeah. Yeah, God, the countdown. Dude. Don Fuck. West losing his mind when he came was fucking just... Yeah. It showed a little his little feet with his bootcut jeans on. <laughs> <walk into> the <laughs> arena. Said, we We've been hearing about we it all a, week. We did a review yeah. on that. Yeah, really. we did. We oh, yeah, did. that's right. We did, yeah. We talk, we've been hearing the rumblings all week long. Yeah. God. It's awesome, dude. What a good theme, dude. So good. Now it's the tough part, though. Because... Do I like that song more than Just Close Your Eyes? Okay, I'll go first. This is not hard at all. So TNA, number one. <laughs> really? Number two not, at, not even a little not bit? Even, not even a hesitation. Number one, TNA. Number that. two, At wow. Last. Number three, Just Close Your Eyes, Whatever Blonde. Damn. Not That's even a crazy. hesitation. Christian's one of my favorite wrestlers of all time. I think about this all the time. <laughs> this all, I think about this all the fucking time. Yeah, right? yeah I yeah. guess that'd be easier for you. Yeah. Um, At last is a fucking banger, bro. That shit is, is crazy. At I mean, last, just close man, your I, eyes is dope too, but it, it's a close I'm, one between those two. I think just close your eyes is my number one. Uh, wow, did yeah. you just betray the Impact Hive? I think. <laughs> <laughs> Go up to see oh, very, like very oh, sorry, yes, sir. very sorry about the Impact Hive. <laughs> we were hearing the rumblings all week. Damn it, you're right. Yeah, I think yeah. Just Close Your Eyes by, uh, everyone's gonna, I can already fucking, Waterproof Blonde, I can already feel it. Uh, <laughs> Story of the Year? Yeah, that's your favorite? No. Uh, and then, yeah, and then the TNA theme. I was about to say, bro. And then yeah. At Last. You put yeah. some hesitation there. Uh, just At Last know. rules so fucking hard, dude. The raining pyro and stuff, just the whole presentation, like, that fucking rules. But, yeah. But the takeover, like, the TNA song... What, that honestly, just I, encompasses like an era of TNA for me, and it's hard to not have that up there. But like, I think "Just Close Your Eyes" is just so fucking good, and, and he should have been a fucking champion with that fucking song. So, damn it, yeah. that, piss, that makes me angry. Maybe I should yeah. just give TNA the number one slot because they gave him the title. <laughs> it, it, but he, he didn't if, take a pin for two years in TNA. Yeah, I know, man. But uh, fuck him with this fucking "Just Close Your Eyes" song with the uh world title on SmackDown or whatever title they had at the time that he should have beat Cena for. No, it was on Raw, right? Was he on Raw when... Because he was on Raw and then he goes to SmackDown and he's in like a five-way and then he leaves a little bit after that, I feel like, right? Something yeah, he's like with that. Tomko and he said, I think I'm just going to head out for a little bit. Yeah. Go the fact that else. they didn't have Christian beat Cena for the belt is yeah. fucking upset. Yeah. So yeah. his exit and his return were very underwhelming. It's, his last, it's his last WWE was like... Yeah, I think I'm just gonna, you know, I'm kind of just tired, you know, I'm gonna go yeah. home. I'm gonna go. And they, yeah. And they returned, yeah, to EC, the third brand show. You yeah. Gotta be fucking with me. They to the story of the out. year song, like, fuck. And they changed the <laughs> Unprettier to the Kill Switch. Oh, they fucked. Oh, and then Ezekiel oh. Jackson beat him on the last ECW. Oh, That's no. Don't even big remember Zeke. No. But yeah, so I, I'm going to go. Just close your eyes. Uh, Damn, really? I am. Just <laughs> Ezekiel close. Jackson beats him. God, I'm going to close my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Oh, uh, it was a big shitty silver title too. Yeah, Fuck. Christian, that damn it, dude. Oh, His, but I did. Yeah, Christian's ECW title run was dope, though. I, I actually remember how I remember how just deflated I got when Christian was like, "Man, I just fucking can't stand TNA." I'm like, "God, oh, man. that sucks." That I was makes like, "God, me feel so bad." It His does. Was so good. It meant a lot to me. I just like, I just hate that he hated it. I've heard. I, I've listened to some stuff since then because I, I remember you telling me that. And it, anytime I hear him talk about TNA, it actually isn't negative. Okay, well, he was so definitely maybe he's turned very around on negative when he came back. He might have turned time. around on it, so which did is good. Hear, speaking of that, like uh, sidebar, did you hear about Kurt Angle saying that his TNA run was awesome, better than WWE run? Well, that's because it's true. It's true. It is true. <laughs> it's he damn said, I had true. fun and I took a lot of chances. I did a 450. It was awesome. I he was there TNA. longer than he was in WWE? He said it just sucks it was good no, no, because no. nobody saw it. That's what he said. That's the one I saw it. <laughs> yeah, I saw it. it was I four, was there. The 450. <laughs> The 450 where he need like sting in the chest. Oh, <laughs> and the dive off the ramp onto abyss. Whew. Yeah. yeah. All right, back so, to the theme song. So yeah, though. just close your eyes. But waterproof blonde. Uh, TNA theme, and then at last. Yep. Mm. Tony? Tony, I'm gonna go with that Ooh. last is my favorite. Just Whoa! Because, because I came Are you out. Just trying to be controversial? Was, no, 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 really. Because that's when like Christian became on his own, you know, and it like, like made him that's a what the song guy. Said. Did say it in the song. Yeah, that's what the song and said. Yeah, and then that that one. I think you're just, just being controversial. No, no, TNA won next, and then just close your eyes. Number two. What did you say was number two? TNA. 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 And then okay, just close good. your mm-hmm. eyes. TNA one okay. still goes hard. Well, TNA is in the top two for everybody. So that's yeah, my favorite WWE at last and TNA. I jam the TNA theme all the time. 
just just randomly just like ha well, hanging out once with uh once cheese made that video i had put the evanescence og song on my fucking spotify dude <laughs> i right. watched that video 900 goddamn times it's so good i'm gonna go watch it when we're done goddamn times. if you guys haven't if, if somehow you have you missed the christian video uh, I'm pretty sure it's on our website, right? DeadlockPW.com. If yes. not, it's on our Twitter. Um, Christian video that she's made. It's an all-timer. It was TNA run. speaking it's of music so videos, if you ever want to find a song we used, I made a Spotify playlist of all the songs. I was wondering who did that. That's a good videos. idea. Yes, I did that. So if you want to good check job. that out, check it out and listen to Christian's theme because it rules. All and let us know what your favorites are. He didn't really have a bad are, one. He really didn't you, have a bad You theme. better agree with me. No. <laughs> <laughs> Number four, the brood. Yo, where yes. the fuck is the impact hive? Let me let me hear it out for. <laughs> no, let me hear it out for the get TNA you got impact hives. That's what you got. <laughs> Just close your eyes and you'll see them. Uh, I promise. <laughs>